How's everybody doing today? It's David again out at Reptile Gardens, and we are back down in the amphibian department with Kathy. And today we have the poison arrow dart frogs, correct? That's correct. Okay, all right. And now, poison arrow dart frogs, so are, are these poisonous? If you were to find one in the wild, they would have toxins in their skin. They don't tend to be as toxic when they're in captivity. They think the toxins come actually from their diet. Okay, all right. That, and so the reason that we're wearing these gloves is just because we have toxins on our hands that... Because all amphibians absorb everything through their skin, including their water. Anything that we might have on our hands, hand sanitizers, lotions, whatnot, a lot of that they would absorb that and it could be toxic to them. And these are only found in the tropics then, or...? They're mainly a Central and South American type of amphibian. They live in the rainforests. And there's, like we said, a wide variety of different colors. And I mean, we have them, I've seen blue, I've seen red, I've seen some of the ones that have yellow on them. So, I mean, they really have endless colors. That's really. why they are just so much fun. We could do an entire display of all the different uh -huh. dark rocks there are in the world. And now what would this guy eat in the wild? He would eat, I feed him little crickets. In the wild he would probably eat little ants. They'll eat any tiny insect that's going past them that fits in their mouth. Dark frogs don't like anything that's too big to eat. So if it's too big, they'll pass on it, where some of the bigger frogs will go for mm -hmm. bigger items. So now this one here, red body, Blue, looks like he's wearing little blue pants. That's the Right. What do you think he's called? Um, a uh, uh, blue pant wearing frog. That's what I call him. Okay, good. Good. That was my professional opinion. He's a strawberry dark frog, and he is the blue jean variety because he's got his little jeans on. So I was kind of right. Yes, and you see he's quite a bit smaller than the, the Azurius that we had earlier. Yeah, he's literally the size of your thumbnail. I mean, right. he, he's not big at all. So, the, the, there are so many different species and colors, and they're called poison arrow dart frogs. Right. Why do they have the word dart in the name? The natives in South America discovered that if they collected the secretions from the dart frogs, they were able to dip their darts or their arrows in that toxin, and it would help them in their hunting because it would poison the animal they were after and that made it easier for them to find something to eat that day. I suppose that this is my first time ever holding one of these little guys. some of your questions about poison arrow dark frogs. Kathy, thank you very much. And we'll see you again soon. See you soon. Bye guys.